Missouri, KTN News. All right, so now that's Rebe, my colleague Ashley Missouri gives us a breakdown of some of the members of that uh, commission. Back into leadership when it comes to that commission is a former Kiambu governor, Ferdinand uh, Waititu, a.k.a. Babaya. We also have a representative from the River Rhine communities, Eva Muhia. We also have Elizabeth Wadhuti, who will be representing the civil society. And, of course, Elizabeth has been very vocal about environment issues representing Kenya also during the COP27. Uh, COP you also have Kalota Dalago representing the private sector. We also have Elijah uh, Biyama representing, who is expected to represent the academia. Also representing the academia, we have lawyer Duncan Ojwang, who will also be part of that commission. But also from the Nairobi county we have also a representative right there that is mumo musuva he will be representing the nairobi county government and also representing um uh, also representing uh the ministry the national government but through the ministry of environment and forestry we have grace senewa mesopir now those are some of the members of that commission let's have a look at uh, the term of the commission so the members of that commission I uh, is supposed to hold office for a term of three years, renewable once uh, based on their performance. So the term can be re renewed, but this, this will be based on their performance. Then the commission will be financed uh, through the national um, government and the Nairobi County government as well as donors. That is something that the president has said in that Gazette notice that was gazetted today. So now let's have a look at the mandate of this commission. Now, the, one of the mandate is to sort out the filth in the capital city and make Nairobi be a place where people can enjoy it like before the other mandate the commission is expected to reclaim the rivers of nairobi as a spine to the city's blue and green infrastructure for a better urban environment and quality of life then you also the other thing they ought to do the members of that commission is to examine previous reports and recommendations made to reclaim the nairobi river and adopt lessons learned in the new initiative so now um uh, that is uh, what uh, uh, the commission members of that commission are expected uh, to do when it comes to their mandate in that office it's a three-year mandate but their term is renewable but this will only be done uh, the president said this can only be done based on their performance so if they failed uh, if they fail to achieve no not actually achieve but if the term comes to an end and they've not finished the mandate the work they've been given by the president um, um, then it means that their term can will be reviewed so members of that commission you've given your breakdown and the pictures of some of the members of that commission and one of the common faces that we've seen is that of Ferdinand 22 and also um, of an, another Kenyan who's very vocal about matters environment so far you're up to date with what is making the headlines here on a KTN news a short commercial break <laughs>